I have to parse one more Talaian scroll. Don't forget what Sister Task says. Seem agitated, sister. A new evolution. <laughs> the Talayan Maybe those anchorites aren't so bad after all. Didn't you call them weirdos? That was before Seer told me they're helping those poor refugees hide from the Empire. That right? Yeah. Working with the group called the Hidden Path. Real hush-hush stuff. So keep it in the family. Understood. It was nice to see everyone again. Yeah, it really was. So, Cordova thinks we'll find out how to cross the Abyss by tracking down Dagon's old haunts? That's right. You ever been there? Once. Used to be a settlement. Now it's just a bunch of crumbling stone spires and creepy ruins. Time to land. Get up here. Master Cordova's research shows an abandoned settlement past the east side of the valley. Let's go check it out. Just Cal will do. It will not. Okay. You don't look like the other prospectors. No, no, no. They unearth riches. Too lot excavates that which cannot be so easily grasped. Make a lot of credits in that line of work? Wisdom is a good that never decays and is always in short supply. You know anything about the High Republic settlement off towards the swamps? Well, of course. The whole area was devastated when the moon fell on it. You're heading there, aren't you? Yeah. Need some information from the ruins. Uh, watch your step. Rockfall is a big problem. Unless increasing your friction coefficient is another one of your talents. <laughs> that was a physics joke. Okay. Thanks for the warning. I know what you are, for what it's worth. Do you now? Sure. The way you carry yourself. That saber on your belt. I won't say anything, of course. Why not? The bounty could be your ticket off-world. And I've already told you enough about my past business to land me in an Imperial intake yard. Guess I'll have to settle for honor among outlaws. Look, 
I know what it's like to have a losing streak tied around your throat. And I respect anyone who keeps fighting even when the chips are down. You're a hard man to read, Moran. Then, as they say, I've still got it. Private table. All right, then. Whoa, easy, Grok. Sorry about my friend here. He's just a little guarded. Yeah, I get it. <laughs> Name's Dana. You might say my partner and I have a talent for turning opportunity into profit. I'm Cal. This is BD. Noisy little thing. We're thinking of heading to Dredger Gorge. Ever been? Once or twice. I'd be careful out there. That's gang turf. Gang turf? Grok! Sure it ain't that bad. The hell I'm risking my neck on gang turf. <laughs> hey, it was great meeting you, Cal. Got some business to discuss with my old pal here. <sighs> Come on, BD. So how'd you become a music producer? I was born on Riosa, in the inner rim. I've heard of it. Lots of heavy industry. Yeah, you couldn't escape the factories. So I used to make little tunes out of the noise from them in my head. You started early then. And never stopped. Hey, buddy. Hiya, Cal. You and Droid seem to get along, don't you? Sure do. Always had trouble connecting with people. Droids are logical, easy to fix when broken. People are unpredictable. No kidding. But once you find the right person, it gets easier. Hope so. Cal, look at this saloon. Monk's been really busy. And I helped by staying out of the way. Did you know there's even a garden on the roof? Yeah. I've seen it. You know what I like about plants? When you talk to them, they can't just walk away. Does any of this interest you? Tuesday. Should you find any data discs from my day, I'd be happy to decrypt them for you. I imagine there are many that remain lost on Kobo. We'll let you know if we do. Who taught you to hunt, Mosey? Well, I grew up in a large family. My siblings and I competed with one another for attention, praise, food sometimes. Had to be the strongest to stand out. Sounds intense. Yeah, Mama was hardest on me. Always pointing out a mistake, criticizing my techniques. That must have toughened you up. Yeah, it likely did. But I've come to resent it. Probably the reason why I flung myself here. I barely knew my parents. Yeah. Well, that ain't always a bad thing now, is it? Hey, got a sec? Watch yourself around the stone spires, Cal. What'd you hear? Apparently the Raider base isn't too far from there. Thanks for the warning. Ready to ride. Yeah.
Let's move. Keep our photoreceptors peeled for hostile. Our Good, Neko. How did someone sneak in? Take him down! I'm stepping back! for the help. I hear you, BD. Let's see. Good, Neko. Let's go. Help, please!
Come on, Neko. Here we go. Let's go. You know your way around Kobo, don't you? We should be getting pretty close. I don't see anything like a settlement, though. Time to go. in ruins. Oh, nice 
nicely done? Name's Cade Fander. This mud scuffer picked up your trail outside the outpost. Cal. Sounds like you've been watching us. Oh, we've all been watching, Cal. Not every newcomer introduces themselves by taking down one of Ravis's boys, which, by the way, nice touch, love a big entrance. Thanks. So what do you want? <sighs> what I want, Cal, is to reward you for every one of these that you take down. Not the only one who came to Kobo for a little peace and quiet. Take these off, bounty hunters. And I'll trade you something nice. So he was Haxian Brood. More bound to be on the way. Exactly. Lucky for you. I've got eyes and ears about. Drop by the saloon. I'll help you get a jump on those hunters. All right. I'll think it over. Everybody's got rockets except me. Not a bad find. Come on, buddy. We still got to find Dagon's retreat. Feel the planet and everything connected. Then reach out. I think I... I, I there! I, I felt it! Just so. Very good, Parawan. Junk work. Maybe I'll just smash this stupid thing apart. to be the place Cordova was talking about. Breathe.
the only ones looking for something here. Think it could be Dagon? Is that Centauri Cree? in order to prepare yourself to traverse the abyss. But in success, will you also find an ever greater connection to the Force? our shared goal, Tanalor. Centauri Kree was training Jedi for the journey through the Abyss. that updraft across? Catch that updraft. I'm sure Z can decrypt this for us.
world the Republic reaches out to, there are new opportunities to share and learn, and this planet has much to teach us. What did you learn, Centauri? Wonder what secrets this place is hiding. Kobo matter. It's overgrown. matter originates from deep within the abyss. This strange substance is enigmatic, but not beyond our ability to study and manipulate. Like all things, once understood, it can be channeled and thus controlled. We're studying cobalt matter in the abyss. Is that how Dagon made its tail work? Neat trick, buddy. and the Jedi Order can understand the mysteries of the galaxy and harness them for the greater good. The Force guides our path. Sounds like the Order I remember. Everything Kree built here was destroyed by a catastrophe she couldn't foresee. Sometimes it feels like history just repeats itself.
Master Kree talking of their dreams for the Abyss. It is unbecoming to gossip and to eavesdrop. Yes, Master. My apologies. Should be able to ride the updraft to the far side now. Those who ask questions find answers. Great timing. I begin to worry for this project. It is not our place to question. Well, even the Padawan sends something amiss. of peace threaten the galactic frontier and our republic. Once we cross the abyss, Tananor could be a bastion to repel that threat. A beacon for hope and justice across the outer rim. Tanalor was more than a mission to her. It was a dream of a better future.
bet we can use her grinder to clear the matter. I need to clear that Kobo matter to create an updraft. So long. I came as fast as I could. My master is insistent. Well, you don't have to worry about that. Not back here. Search inside. What is it that he expects me to find? Arming raiders with lightsabers? Good thing they're not trained to use the force. Hey there.
Hey, BD, a little help? Nice. getting through. Strange device. Looks broken. He is coming. Destroy it now. Whatever this device is, Dagon killed other Jedi for it. This thing's got your name all over it. I think Master T'Pol had this one. That window leads back outside. Centauri Cree had a lab on Kobo's move. Maybe we can learn more there. Yeah. Let's go, BD. Stay safe, you hear?
Come on. Good BD. Thanks for the assist. Let's move. Pick our destination. Route to the Shattered Moon. Next up, Kobo's Moon. That's my line. Know your role. You shoot things. Me, I'm the pilot. So, you give that old tech Cal found in Dagon's place a look? Yeah. Maybe that lab on the moon will shed some light. What do you think happened to it? The moon? Ah, who knows? Who cares? I don't got time for moons. Some sort of natural disaster, I'm guessing. Eh, maybe. I'm surprised the moon's still habitable. You and me evidently have different ideas of habitable. I know. I've seen your cantina. Watch it. Eyes front, Cal. We're coming in. Smidge rusty. You? A little restless, but we'll be fine. Oh, listen to you, Mr. Optimistic. <laughs> hey, you want to do me a favor? Cut it out. You're giving me a stomach ache. You sure, it's how you're cooking. <laughs> what was that? We're almost there. Locals say the moon's haunted.
They couldn't have put this laboratory in a sunnier place? No kidding. But if we find something here that'll help us navigate the Kobo Abyss, so be it. The way Grease tells it, the Abyss is a ship graveyard. And now we're on a lunar graveyard. A lot of graveyards. A lot of graveyards. Closed. They're here. Who's here? We've been attacked. Evacuation protocols in order. <laughs> Reminds me of the forest array, just on a much grander scale. <laughs> Cordova said there were records of Dagon visiting a lab on this moon. It says Cree written all over it. So not that way. Didn't expect to see this place operational after all this time. But stay alert. I need to find that lab. There's something past the abyss. Centauri Cree does. I suppose that's enough for the council. Need to center myself. Okay, let's go. Excuse me. reading not holding we'll need to reinforce the chamber again
good enough! Stay put! Hey, BD! Bad feeling? Yeah, me too. do they?
We need to use this.
fini Romy's been beat. I'm okay. Not out of it yet! Kidding me? Nice work, buddy. Sector 5 Delta, no anomalies. Scanning. Sector 5 Do what you gotta do, buddy. No anomalies. Scanning. Sector 5 Zeta. One anomaly. The sky is broken. We've been attacked. Try some new components. Done yet. We can do this. Not feeling so great, BD. Ready, BD? to talk so much. What a haunted old ruin. But if the boss says there's something here, who am I to question it?
Nice find. Let's take this back to Z. Fine. Good job. Let's show this to Z. Make sure the way is sealed. Not even that Jedi scum. Target is a coward. That's right. We should send word, let them know we spotted him. I would prefer to kill him myself, but... Right? That's one. Fucking, Another one down. Nice. You cannot last. Sounds like they're defending something important up ahead.
target is approaching high value location. Initiate defense. He will not pass. You're up. Getting to it. Let's stop for a moment. Back to it.
George writes. Left alone here for centuries. Until the raiders came. To get these back to Cordova. I was promised something interesting, and here, right on time. It'll be my honor to slay you. Salvage it. Back to it. I'll go. I'm the best pilot for this mission and you know it. Every ship we've sent into the Abyss has vanished without a trace. We're we'll go out. together. I cannot let you take the risk alone. This is your invention. No one else understands it. I've seen Ron Yips with more fight than you. You're the only one who can guide me back. All right, I'll record the passage and make sure you, you return to us. Another memory. And you are... No
Hey, BD. One way door. Take this back to Jeddah. Master Cordova will want to see what we found. Let's get out there. Jada it is. Think Cordova can make some sense of that tech Al found? Are you kidding me? That guy is as sharp as they come. I can't wait to see Seer again. I owe her big time. She fronted me the credits for Pyloons. How much do you owe her, Grease? Two thousand credits, give or take. Maybe I'll make Granny Pyloon's famous casserole and she'll forget all about it. For 2,000 credits? That better be one hell of a casserole. This is your captain speaking, inviting you to grab some seat so we can land. 